Today we're taking a look at Western Kentucky vs. Louisiana Tech match, which is happening on Thursday, March 25, 2021 at 10 p.m., and giving you my betting tips and predictions in general on this game. Welcome back to High Stakes, let's get straight into it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to get notified as soon as we release these sport prediction videos. In a fun twist, Western Kentucky and Louisiana Tech, who finished with the two best records in the CUSA regular season, are meeting in the NIT quarterfinals. In the CUSA championship game, Western Kentucky held a seven-point lead over North Texas with just 2.57 to play. The Hilltoppers dramatically blew that lead and lost the game in overtime. Louisiana Tech also lost at the hands of the Mean Green. The Bulldogs shot just 3 for 17 from 3 and scored a pathetic 48 points in the conference tournament loss. However, both just pulled off upset victories in the first round of the NIT tournament. Louisiana Tech outscored Ole Miss by 20 points in the final 18 minutes, winning by 10 as a 3.5 point underdogs. Meanwhile, Western Kentucky dramatically defeated St. Mary's, winning by 2 as 2 point underdogs. This is the CUSA Championship game matchup that we deserved. Let's dive into it. The Louisiana Tech Bulldogs are a number four seed in the net. They are 22 to seven on the season and went 12 to four during the Coosa regular season. The Bulldogs have won 11 of their last 13 games. The Bulldogs last loss came in the Coosa semifinals against the North Texas Mean Green 54 to 48 as a 1.5 point dog on Friday, March 12th. Louisiana Tech defeated the number one seed Ole Miss Rebels in the first round of the NIT first round 70 to 61 as a 3.5 point. Kalab Ledoux led the team with a 22 point effort in the victory. On the season, Louisiana Tech is 78th overall according to Ken Palm and has averaged 74.5 points per game and rated 140th in the nation according to adjusted offensive efficiency. The Bulldogs are a well-balanced team led by Isaiah Crawford with 11.9 PPG, Kenneth Lofton Jr. with 11.4 points and 7.3 rebounds per game, and Kalab Ledoux averaging 11.2 PPG. Defensively, the Bulldogs are holding opponents to 64.9 points per game and are rated 27th in adjusted defensive efficiency. The Western Kentucky Hilltoppers, the third seed in their region of the NIT, squeaked past second-seeded St. Mary's 69-67 to advance to the second round of the net. The win improved their record to 21-7 on the season. Tave and Hollingsworth won it with two cold-blooded free throws with three seconds left to give WKU the win. Hollingsworth led the Hilltoppers with 21 points and two steals while Charles Bassey had a double-double with 19 points and 11 rebounds. Josh Anderson and Luke Frampton each added 10 points for the Hilltoppers. Western Kentucky only shot 45% from the floor but they forced 10 St. Mary's turnovers and had 6 steals. They only had 4 turnovers. The Louisiana Tech Bulldogs look for another win after beating Ole Miss in the first round. The Louisiana Tech Bulldogs are averaging 74.5 points on 44.8% shooting and allowing 64.9 points on 40% shooting. Isaiah Crawford is averaging 11.9 points and 5.2 rebounds while Kenneth Lofton Jr. is averaging 11.4 points and 7.3 rebounds. Kalab Ledoux is the third double-digit scorer and Amory Achebald is grabbing 3.1 rebounds. The Louisiana Tech Bulldogs are shooting 34.2% from beyond the arc and 68.1% from the free throw line. The Louisiana Tech Bulldogs are allowing 29.2% shooting from deep and are grabbing 36.3 rebounds per game. The Western Kentucky Hilltoppers look for another win after beating St. Mary's in the first round. The Western Kentucky Hilltoppers are averaging 73.9 points on 45.6% shooting and allowing 68.5 points on 42.3% shooting. Charles Bassey is averaging 17.7 points and 11.4 rebounds while Tave and Hollingsworth is averaging 13.9 points and 3.7 rebounds. Josh Anderson is grabbing 4 rebounds and Jordan Rawls is dishing 1.9 assists. 
the Western Kentucky Hilltoppers are shooting 34.3% from beyond the arc and 78.1% from the free throw line. The Western Kentucky Hilltoppers are allowing 36% shooting from deep and are grabbing 35.5 rebounds per game. The Bulldogs are 5-0 ATS in their last 5 games following an ATS win and 17-5 ATS in their last 22 games overall. The Hilltoppers are 5-2 ATS in their last 7 Thursday games and 5-2 ATS in their last 7 neutral site games. The under is 11-5-1 in Bulldogs' last 17 overall. The under is 4-1 in Hilltoppers' last 5 overall. The underdog is 5-2 ATS in the last 7 meetings. So here are my betting suggestions for that game. There's an argument to be made for both Western Kentucky plus 1 and Louisiana Tech minus 1. However, the under is the smartest bet in this game. Western Kentucky's perimeter players, everyone outside of Bassey, will have issues against Louisiana Tech's size and length. The Hilltoppers won't be able to score from deep. Meanwhile, Louisiana Tech's frontcourt will struggle mightily against Bassey on the interior. The Bulldogs take 41.3% of their shots at the rim, which ranks 56th in the country, and Bassey is going to make it tough to score at the rim. Bassey scored 24 and 14 points in his two games against Louisiana Tech this season, and I expect him to be dominant again on the interior. However, despite Bassey's best efforts, both games still went under the total by a considerable margin. In fact, the under is 5-1 in the past 6 between the Bulldogs and the Hilltoppers and 6-3-1 in the last 10. Moreover, Louisiana Tech is 6-3 to, to the under in its last 9 while Western Kentucky is 4-1 to, to the under in its last 5. All of this is very predictable, as both teams are elite defensively. The total in this matchup is set at 137, but the average score of the two games between the Bulldogs and Hilltoppers this season was just 125.5. Finally, at the time of this writing, the big money is on the under. The under is receiving just 50% of the over-under tickets but 92% of the over-under handle. Between the offensive matchups, the trends and then the smart money, I love the under in this spot. My first betting advice for that game is to pick under. Typically tournament games feature two teams that have never played against each other in years, maybe decades. There is no familiarity and that can make it fun and interesting. But it's also fun and interesting when you get a matchup like Western Kentucky versus Louisiana Tech. They played two games this year, split both of them, and both were close. They won their respective divisions within Conference USA and even lost to the same team in the conference tournament, North Texas. There will be no surprises here and this game will come down to the final minute. But I like the Bulldogs here. They have been playing better down the stretch and they looked great in knocking off the top seed. Take Louisiana Tech to cover. My second betting advice for that game is to pick Louisiana Tech minus one. Good luck to all of you. That's it for this video. Stay tuned and stay safe for the next betting tips and advice.